It is Mo Gabba Day here at Oriole Park at Camden Yards, and an emotional one. Sanzi Gabba, Mo's mother, and a ceremonial first pitch to remember to none other than Adam Jones. This is, in fact, the third year anniversary of his passing, which happened three years ago on this day, July 28. Well, the Yankees have been without Aaron Judge for 42 games. They had to wait an extra two and a half hours today because of a rain delay, but he is back. He's in the lineup, and they are hoping that he can return them to their winning ways. At who's starting for the Orioles, David? Well, it's going to be their young top prospect, Grayson Rodriguez, be his 13th start. A little bit of a mixed bag. You can see he's given up 13 home runs, although he does have 66 Ks in 56 innings. And this one's looped out to Adam Frazier at second base, and there's one away. Here is the sound for Judge. Yankees been a mess without Judge, <laughs> and the first pitch is lined to right field, and it is caught. So he hit it right on the screws, but Santander ran it down. Two outs. Well, here's Anthony Rizzo. He's at 2.46, 12 homers, 41 RBIs. He struck him out, and he did it with the gas on 100. That's how you want to get the party started, Grayson Rodriguez. How about rare back and give me a hundy right out of the chute? And there is Garrett Cole towing the slab at Camden Yards here tonight on a Friday night. This will be his 22nd start on the year. The numbers are really good. Home runs only 13. Give it up. Henderson wraps on the right field. Stanton is there to make the play. One pitch, one out. Here's Adley Rushman. 19 career games against the Yankees. 26 for 73. That's 356. Line drive right at Torres. Two away. Here's Santander. Popped up left side. McKinney coming on, he's there, and shallow left puts it away. A 12 pitch, one, two, three inning for Garrett Cole. We played one in Baltimore, nothing, nothing. Mayhew with eight walks in his last 22 plate appearances and four hits. He struck him out. Well, he missed the spot, but sometimes when it's triple digits, you can get away with it, especially in a two strike count. Rutschman to the outside part of the plate, but Grayson just powers his four seamer, just kind of up and in and no chance. And another one, two, three inning for Grayson Rodriguez. To the bottom of the third. Here's rookie left hand hitting center fielder Colton Kowser. Strike three. Kowser down looking. He'll slow it down on the outside part of the plate and he'll buzz you over 98. Perfectly done. See how that ball comes back a little bit too. It starts in off the plate. He just works it right back over the inside corner. And a one, two, three inning for Garrett Cole. Where three complete. Still no score here at Camden Yards. Now here's Judge. Judge first at bat, first pitch. He had a line drive to right. It was caught. And he hit it right on the nose. Did he go? No, he did not. And the Yankees had their first base runner as Judge works a walk. Here's Rizzo. That one is lined in the left center field. It's a base hit. The Yankees first hit of the night. Judge moves to second. First and second, one man out. So here's Stanton lined out the center to start off the second. Ground ball to third base. Urias to second for one. Frazier on the first, make that two. A double play. 5-4-3. Grayson pitches out of trouble for the first time tonight. Orioles and Yankees scoreless. No oh, two down, and here is Anthony Volpe. Roll to third base. Diving stop by Urias. Got him. Come on now. Ramon Urias, how do you do? Takes extra bases away from Anthony Volpe and Urias, who put on a defensive clinic at third base in his last home game against the Dodgers with a little robbery of Volpe and the Orioles off the field in the top of the fifth. Bottom of the fifth inning, nothing, nothing between the Orioles and Yankees. Now one down, and here is Austin Hayes. Strike three, Hayes down looking. Starts out right down the pipe. Works his way right to the corner. Two outs, bottom of the fifth in this nothing nothing game. Sending Colton Kowser. Struck wow. him out swinging. Fastball away. So three up, three down at the end of five. No score. Two Ayers Judge, who has flied out and walked. And went with a change again, and he walks Judge for the second time. Well, the next out for Grayson, if he can get it, will be a new career high going six innings. Ground ball to the left side. Backhanded at third base by Urias. To first, got him. And a new career high. Six scoreless for Grayson Rodriguez on a Friday night at Camden Yards. Two outs the Orioles do have in a tie game. Urias at second base. Yeah, for the first time tonight, the Orioles get a runner in scoring position. But now Santander comes up. Grounded to second. Torres fights it into the glove and a big, big performance by Garrett Cole. 
allowing just three hits. And Grayson still out there, working for the first time in his major league career into the seventh. He got him. Down swinging goes Stanton for out number one in the seventh. 99 on that heater. I guess the tank's not on empty, right? Brandon Hyde out to talk to his 23-year-old rookie, but what an effort for Grayson Rodriguez. And listen to the hand here at Camden Yards when he comes out of this game. Fujinami enters the game. So first and second, one out. And that'll bring up Bader. Both teams with three hits. Both teams looking to scratch out a run. Ground ball to shortstop. Henderson takes it himself to second for one. Double play. Fuji pitches out of it. Big time. Well, Garrett Cole comes out the pitch. The bottom of the seventh inning. Saw the kid do it. He's wrong. He'll do it too. Swing and a miss. He had the right pitch. Two down, nobody on. Adam Frazier is 0 for 2, a strikeout. Grounded to first. Rizzo is there. Season high, 110 pitches for call. Seven shutout innings. That is a big boy performance. The scoreboard, nothing, nothing. Each team with three hits. Well, as Anthony Volpe steps up to the plate. As this is hitting the air to right field, Santander makes the catch. And taking extra bases away from Volpe. Well, how good was this, huh? This Oriole defense has been on fire. Make it nine games now without an error. They have cleaned baseball. And how about Anthony Santander? This ball slicing away from him, and yet he gets to it with an outstanding effort. That certainly saved extra bases. Well done, Anthony Santander. We have two outs. We're in the top of the eighth. No score. Yanks have a runner at first. That's Glaber Torres. It's Aaron Judge. He's walked twice in his return, and he walks for the third time. Danny Kulo comes in. The goal pretty simple right now for Danny. Get Rizzo, get in the dugout, get a run, and get Felix on the mound. Diving oh. stop by Frazier. The Orioles did it again. Gold gloves across the field on this night. It is a glove show tonight for the Orioles. Santander, Urias, and now how about Adam Frazier? Saves the game. I'm talking about lays out full Superman to rob Rizzo and get the Orioles off the field. Well, there's the mountain. Didn't pitch in that three-game series versus the Phillies. Had a few extra days off after a huge series he had against the Rays, making his 46th appearance of the year. Struck him out. That's 102, folks. 102 right to the top of the zone, right by McKinney. We're going to the bottom of the ninth. The Orioles need one to win this thing. Well, here we are, bottom of the ninth, still scoreless. Yeah, and Aaron Boone will turn to his third reliever of the night. There's Tommy Canely making his 23rd appearance. So Canely into the game, not Holmes, which is interesting. Santander will bat. One down, base is empty. Santander to right. Santander to right. And this baby's gone. Some magic on a Friday night in downtown Baltimore. And the Orioles walk off New York. And they win the game, one nothing. Tony Taters. And that's a big fly, folks. Folks, it's a different way to win every night.